All right, in this video, I'm gonna show you how to put an arrow on a photo in iOS 17 on your iPhone. Let's go ahead and open up our photos. I've got it open to this specific photo. First thing you gotta do is go to the top right corner, hit edit. It's gonna take you here. Um, we're gonna go to our markup, which is that little circle with the pen in it. We're gonna click that. It's gonna give us our drop up on the bottom. Okay, so what we have to do to find our shapes is come here, click on this gives us this pop-up. If you look at the bottom, you're gonna see shapes. Click on that. It's gonna give another pop-up. This one here, you can't manipulate or move. So I'm gonna go with this one. So it's showing you it's like a pointing one, and we're gonna click on that. And it gives us this very, very small arrow. You can barely see the arrowhead on it, right? So what I wanna do now is I wanna come down here, and I can change it from an arrow to a line to an arrow with two heads on it. You really can't see it, but let's go back to our arrow. All right, I'm gonna to go to five. And what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna make it as big as possible so that I can manipulate it and then we can shrink it down. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna pull it all the way over and it's gonna be huge now. You see how it jumped up? And if I'm good with it, I'm just gonna tap anywhere on here and that box disappears. I'm at 30 now. It's got a black arrow. Um, if I wanna make it longer, I could grab this little blue dot and pull it back. And then I can change the direction by pulling it this way. See how it kind of jumps? And if I want to make it longer, I can do the same thing on this side by pulling it, right? See that? Now I can kind of manipulate it a little bit. But let's say we want to point it at the plane, right? So I'm going to maybe pull this over a little bit, then pull this over. I'm trying to get it to point at the plane. <laughs> yeah, there, we kind of got it not pointing at the plane, right? Now it's black. If I wanted to shrink it, I could pull it, you know, I can pull it up a little bit just by pushing on the blue dots. Um, here on the green dot, what it does is it bends the interior of it. You see that? Let me show you. So that changes the, like, a, you get a little, like, a bend. Now, if I wanted to put two heads on it, I could go like that. Now I've got two heads it's pointing in two directions. Or I could just make it a line if I wanted to make a smiley face or something. Let's go back to our arrow. All right, let's make it straight. All right, now if I don't like that color, I could come here, I could click on this, and I could change the color. Now there's a couple ways you can do it. You can do it in here. Look at it, every, t every time I touch anywhere, it changes here, you follow me? Let's say I wanna do like a purple one. Then it would tell me it's purple here. It's at 100%, I could change the opacity of it like that and make it more see-through, but I'm gonna keep it at 100%. Now you could do spectrum, which is the same thing, you know, see? You know, it just changes down here. Or sliders, here's what the here's what the number is. You know, if you were writing code, that's what you would be putting in there, but I don't really do that. Or you could just come down here and just do this and get these, you know, primary colors. But let's go back to grid. I'm gonna make it purple, and I'm gonna close it out by touching here. And now look, there's my, there's my, uh, uh, my uh, arrow pointing directly at my plane. You follow me? Now, um, if you're cool with that, all you have to do is just touch it. And bam, there's your, there's your photo. Now, if I wanted to save it, I would come up here and I would hit done. And then I would hit done here. And bam, it goes right in there. And look at that. That sucker is saved. Now I've got an arrow on my photo. Now, if I want to get rid of that arrow, I could go hit edit and I could come up here and I could go revert, revert to original. And bam, it just goes back to the original. And that's how you do it. All right, if you like this video, subscribe to my channel and check out my other awesome videos where I show you cool stuff like this. Peace out.